everybody <laughs> and welcome to the unofficial alien day giveaway for studio yutani um now we've been running a bit late just because we've had to organize stuff and get all the prizes out in a row if anyone wants to see what we've got that's uh all over there now some of these prizes are still at um the residences of uh, the people who have donated so they're in America or um, they're in, somewhere else in Australia so I won't be able to show you the price here but I can tell you that I will pass your postal details along so you'll be able to um, get what you deserve without being sounding too dodgy <laughs> all right today I have da -da -da! Project Asheron with me. Woo! Woo <laughs> um, and, and he came to uh, Melbourne to go watch uh, the Alien and Aliens 4K screening with me yes. at the Astor. Certainly did. Yeah, and it was a lot of fun. <laughs> yeah. I was so tired. I had to have a nap at the beginning of Aliens just because I've been up all day. You also fell asleep in the middle of Aliens. Yeah, that too. <laughs> we looked over and you're sitting there snoring. <laughs> and then the next minute a xenomorph jumps out and you're like pretending you were awake the whole time. <laughs> That's me. And yeah, but now I'm, I'm still tired, but awake enough to do this draw just for you guys. Because that's what I do. And um, we've got quite a few different prizes. Now, where possible... I will actually uh, select the prize that the person wanted. So, so the way we're working it is that there's a, a um, the prize draw, and I can tell you who's won first prize, second prize, third prize, fourth prize, blah 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 blah, and um, then I have to look at what they've commented on the blog. Uh, which prize they wanted if it's already gone then they'll just get a random prize um, but if the prize is still there they, they actually get what they want which is really cool uh, because I hate entering competitions and then winning something really random I never wanted <laughs> so that's why you get to choose your prize kind of um, so uh, first of all I wanted to go through the post itself um, so basically uh, what I wanted to say as a disclaimer for this competition is that we're in no way affiliated with 20th Century Fox or its subsidiaries. Uh, Alien is copyright to 20th Century Fox Film Corporation and all rights are reserved and the property of Fox. And the reason why I'm doing this is because we're not an official competition. Uh, we do not get any Fox backing. This is completely out of my pocket or out of the pockets of people who donate and make this alien community what it is more fun um you know embracing the art of radical kindness which is being kind to your fellow human beings and trying to make our fandom a better place because it was a, a bit rough after uh, alien covenant <laughs> yeah. and and the so release of the prequels or even as far back as the release of alien 3 so you know <laughs> we're trying to like let's talk and relate about the stuff that we like together instead of focusing on the stuff that we don't like basically we're trying to build better worlds yes build better worlds perfect exactly um all the money raised in conjunction with our tea public uh, tea public sales on the studio yutani tea public uh site the sale of the winged uh sun lapel pins which we have a couple to give away today um will fund our community projects and all of that money that we earn apart from the donations that we get through patreon to support the blog and the podcast go towards supporting uh the creative community and um commissioning artists to make original works and, and so on and so forth so we want to make this a perpetual you know creation <laughs> uh, within the fandom uh to enter the competition uh, you all you needed was a Twitch account to follow us or you could comment on the blog post so on the blog post all you had to do is tell me what you love about Alien and you just had to also tell me which prize in that annual 
alien day giveaway did you want most and why so you get something that you want this year for alien day we've had some really kind donations we've had a poster donation from the perfect organism podcast they've given us a copy of the 40th anniversary uh, alien exhibition poster a uh, good friend of ours uh, of Yutani and mine uh, author Alex White of the called forge he's donated a signed copy of the book which we'll be giving away today and also one of our patreon supporters Benjamin Scottford has kindly donated um, a, how do you pronounce that gickly print <laughs> of um, uh, the back versus scene uh, in Alien Covenant and also uh, Emily Vertulo who's one of my admins in um, the Aurigai 6 Facebook group has kindly donated one of the 6 inch uh, ultimate alien uh, action figures from NECA which is the, the blue um, warrior alien to give away so that was really 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 great um, other prizes that we have in store to be won today is the um, signed posters of concept art by Ev Shippard. We'll be giving an individual one away to separate people. Uh, we've also got a Xenomorph pin and patch by Megan Allison Design. Uh, Megan Allison was one of the creatives that we interviewed for our, our fan creatives series and she makes really cute um, alien themed stuff. And I've included a link in the blog. We've also uh, got two printed alien posters by Dane Hallett. So if you guys have been following him on Facebook, you'll know that he's been releasing uh, his uh, alien uh, posters or uh, redo of um, the classic poster. And we've got two of them available, which one features a xenomorph and the other one features an x-ray of uh, the egg. Now, as well as that, I've also got uh, two exquisite minis of the Neomorph and the Xenomorph by Higher Toys, uh, which I'll be happy to do an unboxing with Project Asher on later. Did you want to do that? Yeah, sounds good. Cool. We'll do an unboxing and play with them. Uh, maybe get out some little doll furniture and play <laughs> them. <laughs> It'll be a lot of fun. We'll do a bit of a fun. <laughs> uh, nerds. Okay. Um, we've got an angry old alien uh, to be drawn but that's only for the patreon um, supporters so anyone who's been on patreon and is a supporter of um, us monthly and we have to have had a, taken a payment from you already for you to be eligible people who just joined today I'm sorry you're not eligible for it uh, we'll be doing a draw for that and it's been signed by Tristan Jones and it actually He's written it so the alien looks like it's saying Happy Alien Day. So it's very cute. <laughs> <clears throat> um, I've also got an A0 sized Alien Covenant poster, which is huge. I'm not going to bother unrolling it now, but I've got it there <laughs> in the tube. Uh, and I printed that from a 4K resolution uh, picture that I managed to get a hold of. Um, I've also uh, got a couple of um, winged sun pins that I can give away. And we've also got some of the postcards from the previous uh, art that we've commissioned to give away as well. So no one is really going to be leaving this uh, unofficial Alien Day giveaway without a prize. Uh, the only thing that might be putting a spanner in the works is uh, time and money. And the reason why I say that is because it's going to take time for prizes to get to you and it's going to take money for me to post it to you. So you've got to be patient. Um, these prizes are free. I'm not asking you to pay for postage. Although if you want it to be uh, shipped faster, you can pay for postage and I will pay you back. Uh, so, yeah. Because I don't have a job, <laughs> this this is this is not cheap. I get pocket money and then I and then I invest it back into the the community. So I've got some postcards available for you, um, available for people if they want them. <sighs> All right, <clears throat> I'm just about run out of breath. So first off, uh, first prize is David Aliens EC, who uh, her, is from. Ecuador and um, 
he has won whatever he wants. So I'm going to have a look at the blog. The best prize of all. Yes, exactly. Uh, I'm going to see <clears throat> what he's commented on the blog. And if he hasn't commented on the blog, then I will choose the prize for him. Okay. Ooh. Doesn't look like he's commented. Bum, bum, bum. Looks like he's doing what he can. Yep. And let me have a look. So... First prize, um, you get a sticker. <laughs> Hold on. I'll get it for you. Which one do you want? Yeah, it's the David and his children sticker. Ta da! It's a very cute little sticker. This is one that we uh, commissioned. Um, uh, oh, I can't even pronounce her name. Samor de la Dovalina, Samira Dovalina, uh, from Russia, I believe. And uh, she drew this for us, and she's part of our Artists Guild. Uh, but don't worry, this isn't the only prize you're going to get. You're going to get a, a pin and a postcard as well, but I'll get Maitland, who was Project Asheron, to help me choose a pin. So you just reach in there, <laughs> grab a pin. We don't know what color it's going to be. Silver. Silver. Woo. All right. And then we'll, I'll give you one of these postcards. We'll give you an ash one. So there's some very, so ta-da. This is for David Aliens EC. I'm going to have to uh, get some envelopes out. There we go. More envelopes. So that is for him. Um, now, let me just get a notepad so I can write down who the winner is. I'm so organized. I really should have had this already before the podcast, but live cast, but who cares? <laughs> As you said, it's mostly winging it. Yeah, that's right. We're winging it today. Find ourselves along the way. <laughs> so I will get in touch with the winners and you'll have to give me your address. And, and you could also choose to not have the prize given to you. You could have it sent to someone else if you want to give me someone else's address. But make sure you, you let them know that they're winning a prize so they don't randomly think that they've been sent something. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <clears throat> the next uh, prize winner is Robert Burkhart. And uh, he is in the USA. Let me see if he's commented on blog nope we're choosing a prize for him i will let uh i'll let you choose a prize for him this time oh you shouldn't give me this much responsibility um how about what can i choose from anything there anything there like um <laughs> Do you want me to choose it? <laughs> yeah, he's just just the not not the um, angry old alien because that's for the patrons. What about the near morph? Near morph. Yep. Cool. Neo morph me. Ta da! There we go. So Robert Burkhart gets the alien near morph. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll get you to pick a pin as well. Another silver. Is that silver or is that gold? That's gold. That's gold. <laughs> gold. Nice. Blingy. And I'll get you one of these postcards as well. So. Will it fit in 
this bag? Yes. It's good. <laughs> so Nemo is in there. Thank you, Robert. So if you're all wondering how I did this, um, this competition is run through an electronic website and everything is chosen. So I don't get to choose uh, who the winners are. A computer does it. And I can, <laughs> Maitland can verify that for me, that I'm in no way <laughs> making this uh, skewed to any particular persons. We're leaving the important uh, jobs up to AI. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. That's what my channel is all about. Because basically we're lazy humans. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we will be replaced very soon. As soon as automation can okay. replace us. I'm sure there'll be a, an actual computer mother 9000 one day who can do these alien day jaws. And Absorbs I will... your personality. Yes, and I will relax on a beach somewhere sipping Mai Tais or something. <laughs> Now, uh, the next uh, prize winner for uh, third prize, it's, it's not really like first prize, third prize, it's like whatever prize they want to choose, uh, is Benjamin Scofford. So, uh, Benjamin, let's see if you've commented on the blog. <laughs> <laughs> You've got to have some comments. He did comment. Oh, he did. Okay, I'm going to read out the comment because that's something different. Um, okay. Oh, hello. Uh, sorry, I haven't been looking at the chat screen, so I'm sorry if I haven't been replying to people. Uh, let me just read out Benjamin Scottford's um, post and then I'll get right back to you. Okay. Uh, Benjamin Scottford says, what I love about Alien. Uh, sorry, I'm trying to scroll and it's doing all these weird things. Stop. Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> okay. All right. We cool? We cool. Okay. Uh, Benjamin Scottford says, What I love about Alien is the production quality and the atmosphere present in the films, particularly the Ridley Scott directed ones. And also how fun it is to be a fan. Oh, sorry. To be an Alien fan with a great community of people and lots of fun content for us to enjoy. Oh, so sweet. <laughs> Uh, the prize I'd most like to win is Dane Hallett's Egg Face Hugger poster. Ta da! Well, <laughs> may I present you with your prize? Yay! So, Benjamin Scottford, I will uh, roll this up and post this out to you. And I, I know you've already got all the postcards, so I'm not going to bother sending you another postcard, but we will send you a pin. Da, da, da. Golden pin. Gold pin. You have been promoted to rank of captain. <laughs> Wait, are they actually ranked? Yeah. Oh, they are? Yeah. I didn't know that. I thought it was just random. <laughs> <laughs> no, they're ranked. <clears throat> so, I will um, <clears throat> give this to Ben. How exciting. Thank you, Ben. Ben is a great supporter, and he's actually given um, one of the, the most valuable donations for this um, Alien Day giveaway. And it, value doesn't matter. It, any any donations are appreciated. Uh, but he's given us a Gickly uh, backburster print for Alien Covenant, which contains the storyboarding and also behind the scenes photos. It's authenticated, and yeah, I think it's worth like. 400 pounds so it's, it's pretty major thank you thank you ben and and he <coughs> messaged me earlier he said he's working today unfortunately so <coughs> he won't be able to join us on the live stream but there you go you've won a prize and i will make sure it gets to you safely and if you don't mind waiting i'll give it to you in person in november when i go to her. Um, my sister-in-law is getting married so I can save myself some postage <laughs> and send you your prize so there you go ta-da that's awesome okay our next winner uh, hold on before I do that that's right some people were chatting to me 
on Twitch and I wasn't there. All right, so uh, hi, bye, Standard Crux. Thank you for joining us. Uh, I'm trying to message. I thought I already was a follower. We've also got um, Dark Necessities. Hello, I'm good. I'm so tired. So very, very tired. You have no idea. <laughs> And, and my lovely husband, who's taking the kids out of the house so I could do this draw without them messing all of the stuff up. <laughs> it's good. <clears throat> okay, so uh, our next winner is Daniel Ammons. And uh, let's see if he commented on the blog. Do, 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 do. He did! It's the next comment oh, down! Oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So... Okay, so um, I'll read out his uh, comment on the blog. Uh, Dan Emmons says, While the atmosphere, environments, and depth of the world uh, they portray contribute greatly to making Alien stand above other sci-fi horror, the design of the xenomorph itself was what initially caught my imagination as a kid, and it is still at the top of the list. So NECA manages to consistently capture the grey-style form of the creature, so... The figure is initially uh, what I would have picked. However, I don't have a copy of the Cold Forge yet. So a side copy would be amazing. Oh no, what, what do I do? He, he, what, he would like one of those prizes. I guess the first one, the Necker figurine? Yeah, I mean, yeah. I, I think the Necker's pretty cool. All right. It's so, the Blue Warrior, isn't it? Yeah, that's yeah, right. So, I got that one, trust me. You're not going to regret it, dude. Dan... Emmons, I will let Emily Bacillo know. Seven inch alien warrior. Yay! It's on the list. <laughs> All right. I don't have it here. Emily's in the USA. She didn't mail it to me and then I'll mail it out. It didn't make any sense. So she will mail it to you once i grab your address i'll be in touch with everyone who's been drawn out in this job drawn out in this job is that the way you say it i don't know <laughs> i have no idea uh the next entry will be ah oh, guess who is the winner it is martin rumpkins bystander crux Woo! <laughs> Uh, he's, he's just been messaging on the channel, so hopefully he's still there. Um, <laughs> oh, okay. uh, I, can't see, I can't see anything because apparently I haven't been a follower, so now I have to wait five minutes. <laughs> what? It won't, it won't let You've been know. slacking off. <laughs> I made the account just so I could watch your Twitch, and now it's saying that I, apparently I've never followed you before. I've never watched one of your uh, Twitch streams before. Ah. Oh, you've seen my comments on the Twitch stuff. <laughs> That's weird. I don't know why it's doing that. So, yay! Congratulations, Bystander Crux. It's absolutely amazing. So I will write this down. Write down your name. Uh... Okay. And... Let me see, did you comment on here? Yes, you did. So, Bystander Crux also commented on the blog. Uh, they said, thank you for this great initiative and for contributing so much positivity to the alien community. Alien is a big part of my life and being able to interact with people who share that passion and also uh, don't dismiss people who have deviant uh, opinions on what they like means a lot to me. Studio Yutani does exactly that. Oh, thank you. That's so sweet. I'm going to like that comment. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, but you didn't tell us what prize you want. Come on. Come on, dude. Now, now she's going to leave it up to me. <laughs> Bystander, uh, speak now or forever hold your peace. So we'll, we'll, we'll give him some time to answer if like what let me know what prize you want out of what we've got there so what we've got left is the alien covenant xenomorph we've got um the pin by megzi uh the xenomorph patch we've got uh 
Xenomorph poster by Dane Hallett. We've also got uh, two signed posters uh, from Effie Shippard, and we've got an A0 size poster for Alien Covenant. The action figure. So, yeah, would you be able to pass me that? And then do a draw of a pin. So, ta da! You have this one, the um, Xenomorph Exquisite Mini. And we got another gold one. Another gold! Oh! Promoted to captain! <laughs> so many promotions today. <laughs> That's terrible. So, bystander, I don't know whether I've got any. Given you any postcards before, I will give you two. This one and this one. So I'm going to give you the Androids of Alien, and I'm going to give you um, the Predator, which was designed by one of our community admins, Lois Lopez, who is a talented artist. There we go. There we go, Martin. Woo! This is a lot easier than last year where I was like, yeah, I'll just give you a prize and you a prize and you a prize and you a prize. I felt like... Doing a whole Oprah? Yeah, I felt like I threw it It was funny. Um... <clears throat> So the next person is Mads Peter Muller. Mads Peter Muller. And let's see if you commented on the blog. I don't think so. Let me just double check if I can see. No. So we're going to choose a prize for you. <laughs> and you are in Denmark. Awesome. Okay, let me just write down your name. All right. You have been thrown to the sharks, Maz. <laughs> Mads. Um, my beautiful assistant <laughs> from Jake Dasheron. Thank you, Mark. Who's <laughs> um, going to be choosing a prize for you? Alright. How about we go with the pin? The pin's pretty cool. I know I would want the pin. Okay. Ta da! It's so sparkly. If you want to have a look at how sparkly it is. So this one is by uh, Megzi, artist in Sydney. And. I will also get you to choose another pin. Alright. Silver. Silver. And what rank is that? That one is just regular crew member, but you know what? Even the captain can die, so regular crew <laughs> is just as safe. <laughs> just use that. Dallas and Yannick is. Oh, even Covenant. Bloody, uh, what's his name? Didn't even make it out of the pod. Yeah. <laughs> Captain Branson. You just never know. In the alien universe, you can be fucked from the beginning or fucked right at the end. <laughs> just never know. All right. So, Mads, your prize goes in the pile. Okay. And next person is Xeno Park. Woo! <laughs> wow. So. I wonder if Xeno Park is here. Are you watching Xeno Park? The high possibility is generally around somewhere. <laughs> I just saw your hello. Yeah. <laughs> I finally, Twitch has finally allowed me to talk. And now they won't let me again. What is going on? You can chat again in two minutes. <laughs> Why are they doing this to me? I have no idea. Hold on, let me just see the settings. Uh, readable colors. 
They know I'm an avid YouTuber, so they're just like... There. Let's screw with them. Is that better? <laughs> oh, excuse Comment. me. Thank you. <coughs> oh, okay. Alright. Um... Xeno Park. What do you think Xeno Park would like? Um, maybe the Xeno poster? Oops, I had slow mode on. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I had no idea. I, I don't know how to twitch. I'm winging it. The Xenomorph poster? Do you think you'd like the Xenomorph poster for Xenomorph? Or do you think you'd like the Xeno Park as in David's laboratory? Mm. Hard choice. Oh, that's hard. What do you think you'd like the Alien Covenant poster? Because it's freaking huge. <laughs> oh, the big one? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Why not? Oh, it's Dark Necessities are just spamming away. <laughs> Alright. Woo! Okay. Xeno Park wins the giant... Um, I'm going to have to un unravel it now yeah. because... I'll give you a hand. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Tight. Very tight. <laughs> <laughs> tight like a tiger. Yeah, yeah, that's up. This is down, I think. No, no, that's it. Yep. So, here we go. <laughs> See, look at this monster. It's just. Right. Is this huge. in the shot? <laughs> Maybe <laughs> not. Oh, further down. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is the alien covenant poster we've got for. Uh, Xeno Park, and it is ginormous. So, here we go. Thank you. Xeno Park is actually one of our um, admins on Reddit. And he helps uh, post articles and keep an eye on misbehaviour, although we haven't had any problems. Everyone's been quite good. He's a pretty avid community member. Yes. I know he posts, reposts a lot of my videos, so shout yeah. out to Xeno Park. Xeno Park, you are awesome. And we will also... Oh, maybe you shouldn't have let go so early. Oh, it's all gone down. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. All right. Sweet. We will send you... A pin. Alrighty. Right on. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, Mama, At this point, I'm just thinking there's just silver and gold. 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 <laughs> Is it just silver and gold? No, there are rainbows in there. Oh, okay. So yeah. there's a third. But it's kind of like a mix. Yeah. So so gold for you, and I'll pop that in the tube. Boop. All right on the outside. Who it's for? <laughs> Yay for turning off slow mode. Thanks, Xeno Park. You are a legend. Do you know who did the poster for the that one? No one wants to own up to it. I've really? asked all of the concepts artists. Why do they not want to own up to it? I think it's cool. Um, because possibly the person who did it didn't think it was cool. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> so, so no one wants to own up to it, and it and it was the same for um the. Uh, the, um, you know, the, the mural, the, yeah, the mural from Prometheus. Yes. How did you know I was talking about that? I was just thinking. <laughs> it was like brain like... fart. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even think. Um, no one wanted to own up to that. No one wanted to own I up to that. I guess that's because it had a lot of controversy behind it though, didn't it? Yeah. And I think that's why artists don't want to say. Yeah. Because like some people found that. The Alien Covenant poster controversial because that's not what we saw in the movie, but that's not the person's fault. I remember actually hearing like really early on when they were doing test screenings. Yeah. I remember when they said David comes over the city and he drops a payload, but then Xenomorphs come out and start attacking everyone, mm -hmm. and that was the running rumor that there was it was a big Xenomorph attack, not just the black pathogen. Oh. And I was when I went to watch the movie, I'm thinking, oh, this is gonna be good. There's going to be, like, xenomorphs running rampant around the city and that, killing them, and then it was just like... So, I, I, get, I sort of get it. Yeah. 
now if you think about it a little more. Yeah. Because I don't know who spun that lie. I don't know if I've just I was easily deceived or <laughs> <laughs> Who knows? There's there's so many myths within the alien fandom that like now when I hear about stuff I'm like you gotta show me the proof <laughs> before I can believe it. Not that I don't believe you about what, what you've um, said or what you've been led to believe, but yeah, there's just so much BS floating around, unfortunately, yeah. that, that people are just... I don't, I don't know why people do it. They just, yeah. <laughs> why do you think I'm a law channel? I, yeah. try, I try and get two facts. <laughs> I love facts. All right. So, <sighs> I'm running out of breath. <clears throat> The next winner is Josh Rogers. Let's see if Josh commented on the blog. No! <laughs> oh, looks like we're choosing again. So let's have a look. Josh Rogers is in the UK. So, um, yeah. Is the Cold Forge still available? Has anyone said that yet? Because it was we, we chose the figure instead of the cold forge, didn't we? Yeah. Okay, so there's the cold forge, and we got three posters and a patch. And we've also got the um, uh, 40th uh, anniversary exhibition poster from um, Perfect Organism. Yep. Okay. <laughs> the pressure's on. Um, Are you going to choose this one? Yeah? One of the signs? Yep. You're going to choose? No, oh, I've got to pick. Alright. How about we go the top one? Do you agree? Sorry? Pick the top one. That one? Yeah. Sure? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> sure, a, sure. What a pun master. I know. That was totally unintentional. So this is a signed uh, poster by Ev Shepard. And he signed it. Uh, just this um, Friday. Yeah, Friday. Night. <laughs> Friday night. Right. right. Friday night. So, so um, Maitland can verify that is that is actually his signature. <laughs> I was there in the room. I can be the uh, what do they call it? Oh yeah, we were both witnesses. And <laughs> what's that little piece of paper? I am the certificate of authenticity. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he is the certificate of authenticity. I will. I'm actually going to go get. Um, some poster covers so I can write this stuff down because it's starting to get ridiculous. So I will be right back. But guess what? I'm gonna make Maitland be mother for a sec. <laughs> what do you want me to do? I don't know. Talk to people. Um, let me just get OBS up. There we go. <laughs> Is that the chat there? Yep. All right. There's a chat screen on the right there. <laughs> I'll try my best not to break him. <laughs> oh, come on. Have a little bit of faith in me. All right. All right, everybody. you got to send some comments or something so that I know what I'm doing. First live stream, and I'm at a loss. <laughs> yeah. I, <laughs> I'm, uh, I am stepmother. Um, and from now on, there's going to be some, uh, very big rule changes around here. I'm not going to be, uh, keeping the same rules as your previous mother. Wait, was that me? No, that was me on your account. Oh. I was going to say, I didn't remember posting that. Did I confuse you? So, I've been given the title... Of surrogate mother. <laughs> surrogate mother. I say stepmother. Oh, that's so funny. Alright. Bet so you guys have never had a mother with a beard before. Oh no, stay on there. I'm not done yet. Oh, okay. <laughs> don't be one of those mothers that abandon their children. <laughs> oh no, I'm scared. Please don't hit me. I'm not one of those mothers. I'll just make you go to bed a lot earlier. <laughs> Because i got YouTube stuff to do and I don't want to hear you. <laughs> oh, you got like the proper covers for them. Yeah. I was going to ask you, did you have any more of these? 
Have we done the pin yet for this one? Um. I don't think we did. No, I don't think so. All right. Uh, no, that's that one there. Oh, whoopsie uh, days. Keep, keep track. <laughs> they all look the same. <laughs> all righty. Get some nice ASMR sounds near the mic. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we've got a gold captain pin. Woo! Woo! -woo! So many captains. So I many know. cats. <laughs> I'm gonna run out of ships. I don't think we've, <laughs> we've ever had any captain that, that has lived so far. <laughs> it's not a great rank to be at, really. Yeah, but but there are there have been great captains. Dallas was a great captain. Oh, I love Yannick. Yannick's pretty yeah, good. Yeah, Yannick. Yannick and his uh, other bridge officers at the end of the film. Yeah. That's like one of my... Chance things. and Ravel. Yes, yeah. This is pretty beautiful. I really love this poster. I've um, <laughs> I've I've gotten um, I've gotten myself a, a signed copy as well. Yeah, Clara's made sure that she's she's got it just as much as you guys. <laughs> yeah. Are these like actual ones, or did you have these made? I had them made. They're pretty cool. Yeah, so um, one of our Yutani uh, contributors, France, uh, he did the vector of the logo and modernised it for the Covenant style. Yeah. And then I got them made in a factory. That's pretty cool. Factory government. What company did it for you? Just some random ones that does pins. If you ever want pins... Uh, to be able to make pins, just uh, let me know and I'll put you in touch with the peeps. Oh, really? Yep. Oh, well, I might have a business proposition for you later. <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Not like that. Claire's in the background there. That's his girlfriend. <laughs> there she is. <laughs> so there we go. Uh, Alrighty. Uh, well. Alright. This is Project Acro and I'm signing off and I'm giving it back to Mother. <laughs> there we go. Thank you for keeping my seat warm. That's alright. I'm <laughs> happy to help in any way that I can. Even if it's just seat warming. Josh Rogers, I think? Yes, I think so. What was the next name? Yeah, oh, yeah, no, we can't say that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're good. Josh Rogers. Oop. There we go. All right. Okay. <clears throat> so, now, uh, our next prize winner is... Jesse Doc. Now Jesse, let me see, is I'm just gonna move this to the other side. I don't know why it's like this. That's easier. Alright. Jesse Doc is from the USA. Let's see if they commented on the blog. Now, part of the question is, like, what name did you comment under the blog with? And if you didn't tell me, then I don't know which one you are. So, Jesse, if you're there, speak now or forever hold your peace. <laughs> nope. No, Jesse. Looks like you're getting a lot of work out tonight. <laughs> I should put my watch on and I'll get my steps up. <laughs> so, so, Jesse... We're choosing the prize for you. Alright, how about the patch? Patch? Yeah. Patch Excellent. Cool. This shiny patch. Woo. So this is like one that you can iron on. So this is for... Jesse? Was it? Jesse Doc, yeah. I better write down the name first now so I don't forget. 
and special. So yeah, I, I wanted to do this toward the end of both Alien Days because I know people were just going to be too aliened out with all the other stuff that was going on. We can't compete with that. Get a bit overshadowed. Yeah. Not even overshadowed, but just shattered. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's the exact reason I haven't done mine either. Yeah. It's definitely not because I'm unorganized. <laughs> So there we go, Jesse Doc, you get a patch. The next winner is Thor Sata. Let's see if you commented on the blog, Thor. Yes, you did! Oh my god! <laughs> yes. Thank the mighty gods of Greece. <laughs> Greece? That's Norse. Norse. <laughs> oh, come on. Man. I'm tired, leave me alone. <laughs> Yeah, I've, we'll yeah. let you have that one. We've been away for like way too long. <laughs> we're going for pizza, are we? Yes. Pizza? Yeah, okay. or, or we'll go to the pub next door, have a pub meal. Yeah. Um, so I will read out uh, what Thor's written on the blog. So uh, we asked, What do you love about Alien? And Thor Sata has said, There is so much I love about the Aliens universe, it's difficult to pick out one thing. The strength of Ellen Ripley, the attention given to detailing the world and flesh out the look of the technology the men blah, 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 blah. <laughs> sorry <laughs> the menacing unstoppable Zeno and the memories and feelings from seeing the film for the first time as a child I was terrified exhilarated spooked for the next week I ran I sorry I ran to my bedroom every night and leaped into bed so big chap wouldn't reach out and grab me from the shadows Whoa, mm -hmm. that's some serious shit, dude. <laughs> yeah, nah, I can uh, relate to that one. Yeah. I watched the film way too young. <laughs> um, so we asked, which prize in our annual giveaway did you want most? And Thor has replied, so many great prizes here. Thank you for putting this all together. I guess if I could pick, I'd go with the Dane Hallett Big Chap poster. <gasps> it's oh, still available! Yeah. How lucky is that? Oh my god! There we go. The big chat poster is all yours. There we go. Ta da! <laughs> so, we were considering it. It's very lucky. Yeah. Like, um, all of the people who said that they wanted stuff have managed to get it so far. So. Although, with uh, two prizes left, I don't know how well that's going to go. Uh, we've got this one, and then we've got the perfect organism one, yeah? Perfect organism, and we've got the cold forge as well so there's three and then once once we do that i will do a break and we'll do the patreon prize draw yep. and then we'll continue on with random prizes that we'll give away to people sounds good mm -hmm. so oh my god this is really really cool that you got to get what you wanted it's amazing so thank you Thor. that was very well thought out as well that response i love it All right, now my beautiful assistant <laughs> will help choose a pin. Please tell me I'm going to be That's another captain. <laughs> another captain. You're doomed. <laughs> At this point, uh, you're more likely to be a crew than not. <laughs> so there you go. Thank you, Thor. Satire. All right, 
So three prizes left to go. And then we'll take a break. All right, the next winner is Robert Duffy from the US of A. Thank you, Robert Duffy. Let me write your name down before I forget. <laughs> Okay, so um, let's see if they have commented on the blog. I wonder if I can find out who these people are. Nope. So, sorry, Robert Duffy, I don't know whether you commented on the blog. You didn't write your name down. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, let's pause for a sec because we've got some chatting going on in the chat. I'm going to respond. Um, wasn't it true that every scroll in David's lab has a drawing on it, even though they're rolled up? Yes, that is correct. Each and every one of those scrolls have something on it. All right, so we're going to choose a prize for Robert Duffy. Should we give him the perfect organism poster? Yeah, what one was that again? That was the 40th anniversary uh, oh, yeah. exhibition one. Yeah, sounds good. Cool. And I will stand up and walk over for the pink, hopefully, a rainbow one this time. I don't know. No rainbow one. So. <laughs> oh, otherwise, I just look like an idiot sitting here going, oh, I can't wait to get a rainbow one. <laughs> there you go. You kidding me? It's another <laughs> captain. Another captain promoted. Woo. <laughs> We didn't do it for the alien warrior. Can you pick, come up and pick another one? Oh. All right. first before you even receive the prize from the people you are supposed to receive prizes from. <laughs> yeah, Eric, Eric <laughs> was like, hey, <laughs> <laughs> I'm really good at like really shitty cartoon voices but I'm not really good at proper accented voices so you can't ask me to do an accent like I don't know David or something yeah I'll leave that up to mom <laughs> All right. Uh, the next uh, wiener that we have is cat. 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 What is it? Cat. Oh God! Here we go. Ka Kaylee. Ka yeah, I would say that's Kaylee Bridges. Kaylee Bridges. Sorry, I'm K struggling. K a y l y. Kaylee. Is that just another spelling for it? Yeah. No. Sorry, I butchered your name. I'm really, really sorry. <laughs> All right, Kaylee Bridges. Ta -ta. So, um, we've got uh, this one and um, the Coal Forge, I believe. Oh, don't forget, we've also got the Gickly print. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Whoopsie. Um, so organized here. 
Let me see if anyone commented that they wanted the Geekly print. Yeah, maybe that's a Oh, this is really nice. I hope you you've won in the draw, uh, David Laura. Let's see anything from Covenant? You're a huge fan. I just wish I knew who you were. <laughs> uh, a copy of Cold Forge. Balls already one, so I'll like that one. And any poster. That one's already gone. But we don't know who you are. Like if you don't comment what, who you are, then it's I don't. Sort of hard. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Mm. Guess it'll just have to be a decision. Let me see. All right. So we've done. And <laughs> if nobody wants it, I'll take it. I'm sure you will. <laughs> I am sure you will. All right. Um, all right. Let's let's give Kaylee a copy of the Cold Forge. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. And on the topic of the Cold Forge, uh, Alex White has released a new track called uh, Seven Wild Dogs. And it's available now uh, in a link through the blog, the blog, through CD Baby. You can get it for free. And I did the cover art. I know everyone must be thinking she's so stuck up. She keeps on saying she's done the cover art. He stressed to me that I have to say that <laughs> I did it. <laughs> Okay, I was I was gonna totally not take any credit, but yeah, he wants me to do it, so I'll do it. If you've done it, you deserve the credit. Yeah. <laughs> rainbow, rainbow, rainbow. <laughs> Come on. Silver. At least <laughs> look. At least it's not gold. Hey. Yeah, that's true. Something you different. get. person we are winning the draw is Kristen Miller Kristen Miller so two left yeah two posters so let me see if they've commented on the blog Can't tell because you didn't friggin' put your name in. <laughs> <laughs> Can choose the pin though. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> if I actually put my hand in. Um, another goal. Another goal. Promoted as captain. Are you sure <laughs> there is? I'm absolutely sure. There's <laughs> a rainbow one in there. Do you see it? Yeah, there is. Yeah. You just keep on just not. Can't get it. Just keep on not choosing it. It's gonna be lucky last. There's some cosmic force. Cosmic force taking me from You shall not pass. Okay. Um and Chris Chris Chin Miller will get Okay, hold on. 
we'll get the poster that's left. So this is David's lab, signed by Ev Shepard, just this Friday, with a certificate of verification from Project Asher on here. Yes, I can <laughs> confirm. Hundred percent legitimate. That's not like having that's actually the truth. <laughs> <laughs> We tell you about our, our escapades. So we, we got to the Asta like really early and we were supposed to meet up with Tristan and he was at a restaurant with Ev and the rest of these other guys and they didn't have a seat for us. So we we're like standing there like okay. stunned mullets <laughs> waiting for a seat. <laughs> waiting for a waiter to come and help us. Yeah. And then we had to wait even longer for our food and drink. <laughs> oh no, my drink came out first. And they totally forgot to bring him his drink. Yeah, I don't think they like him. <laughs> You're just sh too shifty looking. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, I was wearing a, I was wearing a beanie when I walked in, so they're probably thinking, wow, this dude's edgy. <laughs> mm. So people who get posters, they don't get postcards because they don't want to roll up the postcards. <laughs> So sorry guys, you only get the pin and the poster. <clears throat> All right, now we've got the Gickly print, which is the last one left. And we have, uh, Magdalena Morales. Let's just see if he, she's commented. Uh, can't tell. You oh. didn't bring and put your name down on the blog. Oh, the top No worries. <laughs> but we've got this uh Magda Lena <laughs> Morales. Okay. I don't know whether I'm pronouncing this right, so I'm really sorry if I'm also butchering this. <laughs> uh you live in the US of A and you have one. The Gickly print, if that's how you pronounce it. <laughs> yeah, I've avoided saying it, just so that I don't say it wrong. <laughs> and that was kindly donated by Ben Scottford. Thank you, Ben. Ben is such a sweetie. Okay. Alright. <coughs> I'm going to see if I can get this. <laughs> rainbow, rainbow, rainbow. There we go, Captain. Captain! Let's let's start naming the ships. What are we gonna name the ship? Oh god, there's that many. <laughs> They're gonna have to share the, the cockpit of some of these ships. We can choose a new name. into a box so that when my kids get home they don't end up thinking that all of these prizes are for them and opening them because they get enough presents from mother <laughs> I gave her the gift of life <laughs> the ultimate present yes I've given it I can take it away <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding people I would not kill my <laughs> take it away <laughs> Oh, not kill my children. All right, there we go. So that's oh, look at that organization. By the way, I didn't even plan that. <laughs> I just happen to have empty boxes next to my desk all the time. All right. <clears throat> so now we're down to just pins as prizes. But all right. um, should we finish doing the pins and then do the Patreon draw? Yeah, save the Patreon. For yeah, all right, cool. Awesome. Uh, we'll take some questions. Uh, Bystander Crux says, I'm so curious what the correct pronunciation of for 
Maybe it's a uh, Gilsey print. I'm not sure. I'm sure someone will correct me one day and Release. I'll be like, fuck, I've been saying it wrong all this time. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you're doing. All right. It's gold. You're kidding me. <laughs> you're right. a captain. There we go. <laughs> redraw. 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 It's just my bad luck. <laughs> I'm going to run out of bags soon. <laughs> then I'll start using envelopes. Alright. Who did these postcards for? So, uh, this is done by Luis Lopez Jr., who is uh, one of the Studio Yutani um, admins. Yep. And I, I've known him from a a Facebook group called um, Alien Paradise. Oh, yeah. It used yeah. to be Alien Prequel Paradise. I'm not in that group anymore. Okay. But Lewis is still my friend. Uh, shit. Who am I giving this to again? I forgot to write down. Is it Magdalena Morales? No. no. It? Oh. Did I write it down already? No, no, no. It was the next one, wasn't it? It was Wes. Wes. We already did uh, Morales, didn't we? Yeah. We already put it away. Yeah. That's right. So it's the next one. Wes doesn't even have a last name, and you are in the, the US of A. So I will have to get in touch with you. So you're at entry number 15. And. You entered a lot of times. Alright. I will email all of you shortly. <laughs> rainbow, 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 rainbow. Let's see if I can get it. Where is it? Um, okay, there is one, two, three, four. I think. Maybe so it's got, Gilly print. I've got a quarter if chance it's French. to get this. So. Was there one rainbow in that whole bag? It's gold again. <laughs> Come on, dude. Chance, I love how my chances keep getting better, but I keep <laughs> failing. <laughs> Like with each one gone out of there, my my chances substantially rise to get the rainbow. You're fired for that one. What? What does Ash say? I'm fired. I can't lie to you about your chances. <laughs> <laughs> but you have my sympathies. <laughs> you see everyone roared in the cinema when he said that. Or were you asleep? Yeah, she's that? probably asleep. <laughs> no, I did. Yeah. I was I was awake because I I love the switch between his face and like yeah like, so. you could see I could see everyone like <laughs> anxiously waiting for that little bit to happen. He Ripley is in a, the U.S. of A. There we go. All right. <laughs> Are we gonna get the rainbow this time? That's what this this drawer is gonna be all about, actually. All right. <laughs> Let me get your head in the bag first. All right. Well, that's three. I reckon it's, it's got to be this one. Oh, what? <laughs> it's going to be the last one. It is going to be the last one. All right, we've got another captain, guys. <laughs> Promoted his captain. Wayland Yutani is not going to be paying much for captain roles soon. Because I think got... <laughs> each captain is just dying and we're just replacing them. <laughs> <Yeah>. <sighs> All right. Okay, it will be done shortly. Yep. So that was Lady Anne who won that one. Oh, was it? Oh, sorry I couldn't get you the <laughs> rainbow one. Thank you, Lady Anne. Nearly done. Let's see. The next person in the draw is Yvonne Faubert. This is it. This is mine. Yes. Woo! Rainbow. I finally got it with a 50 50 chance. Alright. So. I will put this one in there, 
and this is for. We want to the next line. Fun. So there. Thank you, Fun. And the last one, we don't need you to pick it because. Yeah. Obviously. <laughs> Although I could still do it, and I could probably get you a gold one, even if there was only a silver one left. <laughs> <laughs> that I can believe. Okay. Okay, apparently bystander crops found out with the proper pronunciations. Oh yeah? Uh clay. <coughs> Sorry? Um he's written Z I clay. Zikli. 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 Awesome. Alice Bob's try. Uh, it's spelled All right. And our next winner is. Ah, Pip Nips. <laughs> Pip Nips. Who is that? That is Phileas Wayland. Oh, is that like the, the, the account on Twitter? Yeah, so uh, he is also known as. USCSS Prometheus on Tumblr. He's have, oh, okay. has over 10,000 followers. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, I'm not on Tumblr. <laughs> uh, so apparently it's pronounced Z Clay. Z Clay. Right. Awesome. Thank you. And I'm just going to chuck in some extras for you. Say it with your most posh French accent. Z Clay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Popping in some extras for you because you are our lucky last. Ta da! Oh, do you want to see what color it is? Yeah. <laughs> Let's do the draw anyway, it's the last one left. Okay. Rainbow, rainbow, it's rainbow. Kind of gold. It's rainbow. <laughs> Oh, did you know that there were two in there? No! Oh, okay, well, there we go. We got another awesome! Rainbow. Another oh, rainbow. Yeah. So, this one is for Pipnips. Thank you, Pipnips. He's also um, a supporter on Patreon. So, Pip. Okay, so let's count oh, how many prizes I've given away. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 19 prizes. I did say 25, but I didn't specify what they are. And the rest of you get postcards. <laughs> but all four postcards, so that's kind of special. Um, but we will we'll do one more uh, because there's a list of 20, and then I do another draw to get the other five. So we'll just keep going until we've got nothing left. So the next person is Satish Menon. Who is the winner? The winner. Ah, oh, did you know I could do a really good Terence and Philip? Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. I don't know why. I don't know why it's specifically Terence and Philip, but oh, I, I can. Come on, let's go. All right. <clears throat> uh, Terence, what color is the wind? I don't know, Philip. Why don't you check? <laughs> you farted. So 
So yeah, that's my hidden talent. That is pretty spot on. <laughs> Anyone would think you're Pakanae. <laughs> so thank you, Satish. You are in Malaysia. Wow, did you know I'm from Malaysia? Or well, used to be. I was born in Malaysia, then I moved over here to the sunburnt land. All right, that's the first 20 done. <laughs> Woo! You landed. All right, so now we'll do the Patreon draw. And I've got a random name picker here. So I'm going to click over to that. That Look. is the same name picker I use. Really? For my I, Patreon draws. Ah, I just Google it. <laughs> yeah, I think it's just the first one that comes up. All right, so just so you guys know that I'm not cheating, and, and this is for legit, we've got our, um, our draw here. So we've got the random name picker, everyone who is our Patreon support, everyone uh, who has donated in the last month is eligible for this draw. And those people may have already won a prize in our Alien Day giveaway, but that's okay because we, we, are, we are rewarding our patrons here. So without further ado, I'm going to click who's going to win. Oh, JB. <laughs> Sorry about the pop-up. <laughs> Woo. Well done, JB. JB wins this amazing angry mm -hmm. alien, which I don't know how I'm going to post it to you, JB. <laughs> Oh, it's like a solid piece. Yeah. Oh, that's going to be a little bit difficult. But I will I'll get a post pack and we'll send that to you. <laughs> <laughs> this alien says, Happy Alien Day. <laughs> and it's been signed by... Where is, where is the signature? Is it there? Is it there? Where'd it go? It's right up near its mouth. Oh, no. It's Daniel the Claw. There. Oh, I'm on the signature. I thought you meant the quote. Uh, there. Yep, right there. T-Rex. So it's been signed by Corona Jones. Oh, no, what's uh, so that what? is our Patreon draw done. JB, congratulations. Now, I don't know how to do this next part. I think I just click it again. Draw winners. Sure. Is this for the last five? Um, I think that's it. That's it. No more. No more. No more. Oh. <laughs> oh no. Well, that's not bad. We've had a uh, hundred and seventy-one entries with a hundred and forty-four actions, meaning that you have visited or gone to one of our thingies. It's not bad engagement. Yeah, it's pretty good. So. Thank you, peeps. Now let's have a look. We'll go archive entries. Oh, hold on, we'll go export winners. And then, yeah, we are done diddly on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm also good at doing Nerd Finders, but I'm not going to do that right now. <laughs> All right, now. That 
that's pretty much it for our alien day draw so i would like to say a couple of thank yous to people who have entered um i will try to get in touch with those people who commented on the blog i will send you at least some postcards so you don't miss out um and congratulations to JB on Patreon. And I'd like to say thank you to all of our Patreon supporters. We've got uh, Benjamin Scottford, Daniel Cooper, Georgina Gray, JB, of course, Lady Anne, Michael Andrews, Project Asheron. Uh, we've also got Sarah Hall, Timothy Cullen, and Zeno Park, and Zachary Rice. Thank you so much. Thank you for participating in uh, Studio Utani's annual Alien Day giveaway. Uh, make sure you head down to the blog have a listen to all of the content that we've put out and also go to Perfect Organism Podcast and to AVP Galaxy because those guys rock and they have done really cool Alien Day stuff as well. And yeah, be really patient because obviously there's a lot of prizes there and I've got a very limited amount of money so I'm going to send things bit by bit so you'll get them eventually. I'll, I'll try to get in touch before I actually mail stuff off. Um, so yeah, thank you all again and mwah, love you all. <laughs> and yeah, that's pretty much it. Alien Day competition completed. Wow, I feel kind of sad. That's the end. <laughs> uh, bystander Crux wants to know where you got your little Neil Moore uh, thing hanging from your headphones. Oh, all right. So this is one of those um, uh, scalers. Let me find a link to that. Sorry, kind of sung out short. There we go. Alien Covenant Scalers. You can get a, a, a Xenomorph one as well. But I got this from my friend Julianne, who also really loves um, Alien, but she doesn't like the prequels. <laughs> oh, okay. uh, she, she loves uh, Alien and Aliens. Which, that's cool. We're still friends. <laughs> we can still talk. I don't hold it against her. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's adorable. I love it. I've, um, and like, I've actually got a pair of Bluetooth, uh, headsets, uh, Bluetooth, um, headphones, and I don't want to use them because then I wouldn't be able to have the little Neomorph hang off my wire. <laughs> So I'm, I'm going to stick with these headphones for as long as uh, they'll work. Okay. And yeah, is there anything that you want to talk about? Alien Day and stuff? Um, uh, look, probably not. I mean, what did we do? We explored the city of Melbourne for a little while. We eventually met up and saw an awesome screening of 4K version we, of Alien. We did go play at um, Be Lucky and Sons. We did. You can go onto Twitter and <laughs> if you search through our feed somewhere, um, yeah. <laughs> you'll see us playing at Be Lucky and Sons at the Alien is that Extinction Arcade or something. Yeah. Yeah, that was pretty pretty fun, but we, <laughs> we died so many times. <laughs> we did. $20 uh, went very quickly. Yeah, but it was a lot of fun. <laughs> Um, we checked out the movie. Yeah. When it had some dinner that we had to eat like 10 minutes before the movie started. <laughs> then we had to sprint to the cinema. Yeah, these guys had to see me stuff my face with a steak sandwich. Oh, we had to do it too. <laughs> um, and then we tried to stay awake through about a four and a half hour time frame of watching Alien 4K, Alien 70 mil. And, and we both aliens. successfully got to sleep <laughs> during that time. <laughs> <laughs> Losers. Yeah. So, so yeah, that's pretty much what we did for Alien Day. Um, and it was really good to be able to, to watch the, the shorts on um, the big screen. Uh, we had some problems with the volume. It was too high, wasn't it? It was yeah. just way too loud. It was loud. piercing at times. I feel like the levelling for that could have been a lot better. Yeah. It was, I feel like it was for like a proper, like a big cinema yeah. instead of like the little like room that we were in. And there were 900 people. 
in the cinema with us. Yeah, it was, it was a lot. Yeah, it was. It didn't look like that when we first got in. Yeah, it looks like it'd be like 60 people. Yeah, it didn't look like many at all. And then all of a sudden he's like, yeah, and there's 900 people here. I'm like, oh, wow, really? <laughs> we missed out um, the alien. There was this photo booth that you could go pose. Oh, yeah, that was a shame. Oh, uh, it's a pity. I, I, was, I even wore my like special dress that has this little triangle blank part where I could stick the chest burster oh, yeah. in. <laughs> but yeah, missed out, unfortunately. So yeah. It was pretty good. Oh, it was. It was pretty cool. Yeah. And then we also got to go to Minotaur. Are you going to go tomorrow? Yeah, I think I'm going to go back. Yeah, Tristan's going to be working tomorrow. So. Oh, is he? Yeah. Yeah, I messaged him. I messaged him on Twitter. I was saying that I picked up uh, Resistance Issues 3 and the variant. Yeah. And he's like, oh, you should have come in and said hello yesterday. I'm like, we did. You weren't there. <laughs> <laughs> ah, slacker. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> And I, I, well, I also want to say sorry to Tristan because he, I was like, I was at the restaurant, I was still freaking out about Alexi falling off the couch and p- yeah. blood pissing out of his nose, and we were rushing to to get to meet Tristan and Ev at the restaurant, and Tristan was like, "Hi Clara, hi Clara, hi Clara, hi Clara," and he was like waving his arms frantically, <laughs> and I'm like, "Oh, hi." <laughs> it must have looked like that I was trying to ignore him, but I wasn't. I was just so like. I was not there, and I think it was the same for the movie as well because I was really tired. So it was a combination of worrying mother for my child and and tired. So I'm sorry, Tristan. I didn't mean to ignore you. <laughs> um, and and then after that, I was just like really embarrassed, and I didn't want to go up to you and say sorry. Yeah. So I will maybe I'll find some time to to visit you at work and apologize. Yeah, I should do that. <laughs> if we see him tomorrow, I'll I'll let him know from us as well. Yeah. Yeah, let him know. <laughs> you, you were here for all of it, so you, he knows that I'm not bullshitting. Because <laughs> yeah, I have, like, really whack shit happen to me and my family just all the time. <laughs> yeah, the chaos of life, though. Eh? Yeah, that's it. All right, cool. So, good night, everyone. Thank you for joining us for our annual Alien Day giveaway. Make sure you subscribe to uh, Studio Yutani. So that is yutani.studio for our uh, website and to stay up to date. Thank you very much. Thank you, Perfect Organism. Thank you, AVP Galaxy. Thank you to Matt Savage and to JW Rinsler and Alex White and everyone else who's contributed to our Alien Day podcast. This is Mother and Project Acheron signing off. <laughs>